All right, this is hopefully going to be a pretty short video. So we're looking for an equation that describes the velocity of a wave. Well, we already have a really simple equation for velocity, don't we? For constant velocity, we can just do distance traveled divided by the time taken to travel that distance. So we can use that idea for waves too. The important thing is that we choose the distance and the time carefully. If we choose the distance to be the wavelength, then the time taken for the wavelength to pass a point is defined as the period. So we plug in our distance and time into the equation for velocity. This is already a version of the universal wave equation, really. But 1 over t equals f, the frequency, so we can substitute that in, and presto, we derive the universal wave equation in its usual form. Of course, it can also be quickly remembered using dimensional analysis. The unit of wavelength is the meter, the unit of frequency is per second, multiply them and you have the units for speed, meters per second. The most important thing to remember about this equation is the speed of a wave is determined by the medium. It is absolutely not changed if the frequency or wavelength change. Similarly, the frequency is determined by the source. For example, how often you tap your hand in some water, creating ripples. It is only the wavelength that is really dependent on the other two values. Uh, so that's it. Thanks for watching. And if you're interested, uh, check out some of my other derivations. Thanks for watching and bye-bye.